This fire box goes back to here and up here. Right here there's a baffle. I can push the wood this far. And this pan, the bottom of it is shaped like this. Okay. So the fire gets pushed up into the box by this baffle here, which gives us this very efficient boil in the pan. It's only two feet across here, but the surface area in contact with the fire is nine feet. My name's Hunter, and I really like this place because um, we got to try all different kinds of maple things, like maple fudge and um, almost heated um, maple syrup and water sap from the tree. That's a big tree. It's a grand tree. It's one of our better ones. Wow. It's just starting to drip there for the day. The sun is coming around and it's warming the sapwood up a little bit. Hmm. Usually it's, when it's running well, it's drip, drip, drip on a tree like this. Okay. But the season is winding down. Okay. Hello, so. my name is Jordan. And today I was testing no, maple John's syrup. And it was John's delicious. Hi, I'm Reese. And my experience is it was fun to be here and taste it. And it tasted really good and I like it. Yeah. So which did you like better, the fudge or the syrup? The syrup. Hi, my name is Lily and today I learned this syrup is delicious. 250 meters to start the evaporator. We like to have about another thousand behind that just to keep it going. Okay. It's a continuous process. It feeds in through there. And these are called float boxes, and they keep the level of sap in the evaporator constant so that it doesn't burn or overfill. Hi, my name is Hannah, and I thought it was a good experiment, experiment that uh, we got to taste that sap. It was really good. Mm -hmm. I like the fudge too. My name is Layla, and I like that the syrup was really sweet. My name is Keely. I learned that there can be fat trees, skinny trees, tall trees, and short trees. <laughs> and they all have good sap, right? Yeah, they have to... honor, okay. and I learned about how the tree, sap from the trees are from the veins. We have about 500 of these taps out. A f a f most trees just have one bucket on them, and a few trees have two, and even fewer have three, because the trees have to be a certain size for a bucket, because it is taking some of the of the sap that the tree needs to produce leaves, so we can't take too many. There's a pipe that dumps it onto the hottest part of the fire right here. And then it feeds this way through here, and there's another box here that feeds it into these front pans, which are called syrup or finishing pan. Starts this sap at about 2% sugar, and by the time it's drawn off it's, as syrup, it's about 66% Sugar. It's great for kids to get outside and into the woods this time of year where mm -hmm. normally they're in a, in a building. It's just great for them to be outside okay. when, when everything's coming back to life. Um, I liked it because I, had, I got to have sugar. Sugar is good. And my name is